Hey guys, what is up? And welcome back to the channel. Do I have an awesome one for you guys today? What we're taking a look at, and I can't believe I found this in Target, is the Pacer uh, launcher from Playmates. Now this is a reissue piece of tosser that Playmates originally originally released back in the days and as we've seen they're making a comeback with everything they've done in the past and we finally got it guys i am so hyped i'm really hyped man because honestly i first of all i didn't think they would do this one and they're also doing the other one the what is it the the toilet something i can't remember right now the name of it so sad it wasn't there because that's initially what I went to find. And then I came across this, which I had no idea they even remade. So that's awesome. That was a good, um, that was something unexpected for me to find, which really made my day, even though I couldn't find the, the one that comes with Donatello. Um, and I got to say, guys, they did an excellent job when it comes to this because I do have the uh, vintage one, the original one, and I have the... Now, as you guys can see, the reissue one and everything is identical. I mean, even down to the colors, I think the only difference is from the vintage one. I will say the, the tires are uh, one shade. I would say that one shade uh, lighter than the tires on the, the um, reissue one. Other than that, the green on everything looks identical. Maybe a little bit lighter on the top part, but man is this an awesome awesome freaking vehicle man it is fun it is fun as you guys can see um you're possibly seeing bevo footage and you already possibly seen the the box the packaging it it is a beautiful box i love that box you can't get rid of boxes like that because they just scream nostalgia right it's so vintage the colors everything about it it's just how can you get rid of that you know what i mean it's it's freaking awesome to see those kind of packaging it, it is kind of bringing me back to to the eight to the early 90s late 80s and whatnot it it does feel that way especially when you're finding these kind of stuff on the shelves i don't know about you guys but to me when i i feel like i'm back in the 90s sometimes and and it's awesome i love it i love feeling that way so man playmates what playmates is doing is selling nostalgia 100 percent, and they're doing a great job man they're doing a great job they're providing the same exact quality or even better than what they did in back in the day so i'm i'm just really happy man it's like i'm a, I'm a kid again man when it comes to these things i i'm happy man i'm happy we're seeing it as you can see um you do have to put the stickers this doesn't come with the stickers on but hey that's part of the fun honestly guys at first i was kind of like annoyed that i have to put on the stickers but as i'm doing it i'm like damn i feel like a kid again you know i'm feeling like a kid again putting these stickers on and just getting them all aligned as 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 good as possible there's always going to be a, a slight little mistake here and there so guys don't stress it um just do the best you can with these stickers but it does it does make you feel like a kid and it, it makes you feel good you know it, it takes away you know it takes you out the real world for a couple for a few minutes and whatnot so it's awesome man as you guys can see the playability of fun factor is there 100 percent the price is at 40 dollars which i think it's okay i wish it was a little bit cheaper because the wagon costs 40 bucks but this has a, a function, you know, you do need three AAA batteries that will not be included on, on the box, on the packaging. And you will see some B-roll footage of me shooting this thing. I will say this, when I have all the all eight pieces that come in this uh, packaging, it doesn't shoot like right away. At least mine didn't. I had to put one single slice and man, that thing flew. That thing flew. I will show some B-roll footage on it. That thing flew, and I forgot who it took down. Who I sh who I think it was Bebop's. Man, it has some power, so it's awesome, man. It really is. There's nothing bad I could say about it. Um, I just want to see now. I definitely want to see um, the news van. I want to see that Channel Six news van, man. I really do, especially the one from Playmates. I know NECA is probably in the works of making their own 
three, four hundred, five hundred dollar freaking uh, <laughs> Channel Six news van. So always Super Seven. I don't know about you guys, but that's out of my league. I can't afford to spend almost four hundred dollars on a toy wagon. You know, I mean, I know, I know that they're doing an excellent job with it, and it's probably worth it. I don't know. I don't know. I know it's not hidden retails. I know they make those stuff kind of exclusive for collectors and it's probably limited quantity and it's on the website only and whatnot, all this stuff. And hey, I don't own it, so I don't know if it's worth it or not. I just, for me, that's out of my price range at the moment to get a Super 7 or a NECA Turtle Wagon. I wish I could, but I can't. Um, and I just, I just feel like that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money for one of these wagons. Let me know your comments down below on that and what you guys think on that. But I hope Playmates make the Channel 6 news runs. That's a little bit more my price range. So let's hope, man. Let's hope. I, I don't see why not. I mean, they're coming out with everything. And at this point, I don't think nothing's out of the question. I think it's just about timing and us just being patient and waiting for these things to hit shelves. Because I think Playmates is doing an excellent job and... I think they know they're cooking. I think they really know they got, that's it, they got us. So I think we're going to see eventually everything re-released. Absolutely everything, guys. So, and why not, man? They're making a lot of money on us, so why not? I mean, as far as I go, they're making a lot of money <laughs> off me, buying everything I can possibly get. So, guys, man, remember, it's a, it's a hobby. It's fun. It's awesome. Enjoy it while it lasts. We're in the turtle golden era, especially for playmates. You know, we're getting a chance to be a kid again. So take it, grab it, buy all the toys you can, collect them, have fun with them, enjoy them. And remember, man, it's just figures. So don't take it too serious and just enjoy it. Enjoy it, man. And with that being said, guys, let me know what you guys think about uh, this awesome pizza tossing machinery right here that we have going on i hope you enjoyed this b-roll footage um not sure of which ones i'm gonna do yet probably turtles all over timing this thing or whatnot i'm not sure guys at the time of recording but you guys should see some awesome b-roll footage on this thing um and i hope you guys find it if you guys are looking for it i think it's worth it and i know there's a there's a couple more things there's a couple more hot items out there uh besides the um toilet kind of thing that donnie comes in so guys let me know your opinion on this awesome piece of machinery here this freaking humongous thing it's pretty tall guys make that shelf space if you do want it it will take up some shelf space but with that being said guys as always thank you for your time thank you for liking viewing subscribing all that youtube stuff let me know what you guys think on the comments down below and i will catch you guys on the next one